side, we just have a quick look at the Canon G12. This has been converted to full spectrum. It's fitted with this filter adapter, which makes life a lot easier than the barrel adapters you usually get, as you'll see. It's actually sprung loaded. So it'll go in and out with a filter without having to put a shallow or extended barrel on. Um, I'll just hold this filter in place because it's too small for the adapter. It's a 55mm rather than a 58 just to show you how to set the white balance up. So as you can see, in um, AWB auto white balance you'll get a purple cast. Um, to set the, take advantage of the custom white balance settings you'll have to be in the program mode or one of the program modes. So if we just press the center memory button to bring up the menu um, you'll see that it's already on the white balance menu what we'll do is just scroll along that until we find the custom white balance settings um, when you find one of the settings that custom one press the menu button to evaluate so in this in instance we're using an 850 nanometer filter so you'll see that it's pure monochrome so if we take the colour correcting filter, we can supply these on request. Basically, these can work in two ways. They can work on absorption or reflection. So this one's a reflection filter. It basically works like the hot mirror. So we can screw that into place. So you see there's now a green cast. So if we go back, well we're currently in the, the white balance menu. So if we press that, then you'll see that the colours return to normal, so you can use the camera for everyday use. The benefits of having full spectrum is to allow you to change between filters. Um, if you wanted to use a camera with infrared illumination at night, you can also do so, so it acts as a night vision camera.